Hi guys, Mike back here, down here at Shakers Dodge Jeep and Ram, down in Watertown, Connecticut. Today we are doing another review on the all new 2019 Ram 4500 Chassis L SLT Crew Cab 60 CNA 4x4. Now we're going to do a quick view of the outside just to show you exactly how much power and beastie that this truck is guys if you can't already see just look how insane this truck is you can do so much with something like this um for all my guys out there or girls that know how to work really hard in the construction business the carpentry business whatever business for that matter and you need something like this this is a definite must see must check it out because this is one truck you do not want to miss the chance on seeing and taking a test drive and just seeing basically what it has in all to offer now as you guys can already see how much of a monster that this truck really is like look at all that chrome guys like wh where do you see this on other trucks and ram is well known for their trucks now this bad boy right here has a 6.7 liter six cummins turbo diesel engine as a heavy duty six speed automatic transmission and inside it has some pretty nice technology as well which we will get to in just a moment now i'm gonna show you the back it is all leather interior has power locks power doors power windows just look at how much room is back here guys look at this seating look at this craftsmanship like what other trucks do you guys see this in some nice cup holders down there plenty of leg space up here for a nice big size work crew you literally could probably fit four nice size adults back here and definitely you could fit a nice size family of five in here very comfortably for all the short people like myself that need a a pretty big step up to get up this is uh definitely a plus because i know a lot of truck makers a lot of automakers don't even have those to get in now you can opt in to buy those and have them installed right when you're buying your truck but to just get them on a truck that is already made is just so much better because you don't have to go through the headache of having them put it on and waiting even longer to get your truck you just want to get buy and go that's that's all anybody ever wants to do when they go into a dealership i know that's all i ever want to do so right here is your power door locks your power windows some nice more leather interior for the passenger and the driver side which we will get to over there in a minute just look at this display guys like look at that tell me in what other work truck has a display and setup like this um this truck has so much to offer guys it's insane uh there's some more space for cargo right here well not cargo cargo but just some everyday space where you could put your some maybe some tools or your cell phone or whatever for that matter uh here's a nice little size glove box pretty standard in all vehicles uh this is a manual side uh passenger side seat and right now we're gonna get back over here there's the nice cummins turbo diesel badge 4500 heavy duty badge and just look at this grill guys like can you just look at it like just take a very long second and look at this chromed out blacked out grill look at these tow hooks guys it's absolutely nuts like ram did a absolute amazing job with this truck it's it's actually insane um again 
The 2019 Ram 4500 chassis cab offer a towing capacity of up to 35,220 pounds, the highest gross combined weight rating of 43,000 pounds, and payload up to 12,510 pounds. Now, the 4500 is a class of four ratings, GVV, GVW ratings, sorry. And additionally, Ram offers a unique 10K GVW class two chassis cab as well. Now this, if you opt in to have the 6.7 liter, uh, six Cummins turbo diesel engine, it does have 360 horsepower and 800 feet, pound feet of torque, guys. Now for you guys that don't know what that is, that is a lot of torque and a lot of power. So anything that you're towing, anything that you're pulling or uh, hauling, this bad boy can get through anything. Let me tell you, it has the nice inside mirrors right here. They go in and then they come back out, which I will get to in just a minute. Show you some more on the passenger in the back again your power windows right there some more space right there for the door your speakers your nice little step up to get in because i'm very short and this is a big big boy truck does have all weather floor liners which is pretty cool especially if you're buying something like this uh again the nice leather seating it has a lot of room in here guys a lot of room Again, this is the SLT package. So it's, this is, uh, it does come in a couple different trim levels and you don't have to opt in for the 6.7 liter. I do believe there's a 6.4 liter um, engine in this as well. Um, but this one is the Cummins diesel engine. So this one has, uh, this, one, this is the one for those, uh, those guys or girls that have those nice big work payloads. I'm telling you guys, this is a truck that you guys must see. Uh, here's some more power locks, power windows, power doors, your mirror sides right here, left and right. Uh, we'll get in just a minute and show you the inside of the engine. Actually, you know what? We'll show you that right now. Here's the latch for the, the engine. Uh, one second for some reason it didn't go through oh that, that was the parking brake sorry sorry guys i'll show you where the engine actually you know what give me one second i'll go back and i'll i'll re-show you because now i feel dumb this was the electric park brake right there or not electric park brake i am very very sorry guys that is your park brake uh latch to pull up so when you push your brake down you pull this up and then it goes back down this is the flash for the trunk or for the hood i mean wow today i'm just messing up all sorts of things guys bear with me uh it's a crazy time right now in our world right now we're going through the coronavirus and it's just insane uh a lot of stuff's on my mind and I i'm just not gonna bore you guys with anything else but it's it's been pretty crazy the past couple weeks uh but yeah back to the review here we go. Here's that nice Cummins 6.7 liter turbo diesel engine, guys. For you guys that don't know, which I'm pretty sure most of you guys, most of my truck guys and most of my truck girls will definitely know what the Cummins diesel is. It's a heavy duty diesel engine. So this bad boy has a lot of torque and a lot of power, guys. Again, we're gonna show you and let you guys know some more details of the SLT package. Uh, show you some more of the down below. Your exhaust tip right there, or not exhaust tip, your exhaust pipe, uh, which is a pretty diesel pipe. Uh, it does have an engine block heater, a heavy duty snow plow prep group, a 220 amp alternator, heavy duty front suspension group transfer case skid plate ambulance prep group so this thing can turn into a lot of different machines guys 
let me just tell you as a 52 gallon rear fuel tank uh, a 40 by 20 by 40 split bench seat which i showed you guys a few minutes ago as a 730 amp maintenance free battery 180 amp alternator rear heavy duty stabilizer bar keyless go speed control active grill shutters it has low beam daytime running headlamps four-wheel disc anti-lock brakes upfitter electronic module stationary elevated engine idle electronic stability control anti-spin differential rear axle manual shift on the fly transfer case ram chassis cabs are job rated so advanced multi-stage front airbags again it has a six speed automatic transmission heavy duty uh it does have the 6.7 liter i6 cummins turbo diesel engine i hope i said that correctly this is the flame red clear coat exterior paint it has a 220 amp alternator uh let's see what else uh, it also has voltage monitoring system uh rear ac heater prep group uh black vinyl floor covering which i showed you guys before electric shift on the fly transfer case a b20 biodiesel capability dual 730 amp maintenance free batteries smart diesel exhaust brake 65 miles per hour maximum speed chrome tubular tubular side steps full size spare tire which i showed you guys on the back just look at that grill again guys i just can't get over how monstrous that grill is it's it's just insane insane guys it does have tire pressure information system tinted acoustic windshield glass a uconnect three with five inch display a power black trailer tow mirrors with manual fold away integrated voice command with bluetooth 19.5 inch by six forged aluminum polished wheels look at those wheels guys like those whams are still spinning <laughs> oh man i'm sorry guys i'm bugged out i know you guys gotta get used to it though i mean hopefully you guys are liking my videos and i, I appreciate anybody that watches and takes the time out of their day to watch my videos because you guys don't have to and again i hope you guys start subscribing so that way i can reach uh higher levels in uh the youtube industry um so that way i can actually do live shows and show you guys where i'm at doing live things um right now i guess i don't meet their quota for subscribers yet because i'm pretty new into the youtube program so i really hope that you guys are starting to like my video so that way you guys can start to subscribe more um it doesn't cost you guys anything to subscribe just it's just something that you can see all my new videos you can see all my old videos and it's just a pretty cool feature guys i mean i i would really appreciate it if you guys did uh if you guys did subscribe it, it would really mean a lot to me um it has a trailer brake control uh it has the sirius xm travel plus sirius xm travel link one year Sirius XM Guardian service, Apple Play, Google, Android Auto. Uh, it has the all traction tires, which obviously you guys could see. And those are the heavy duty tires, guys. Like, this is a monstrous, monstrous truck. And then we're gonna get into the inside again and show you guys some more of what she has going on inside. Oh, one second. Here's your headlamps and high beam controls right here. And here's your controls right here for your steering wheel. Your controls to control all of your um, tire pressure, your fuel tank, um, your oil pressure, and all those controls right here up in the head dashboard. It is a start to push, which is really nice. And you hear that, guys? This has a 6.7 liter Cummins turbo diesel engine, guys. 
and you did you hear that i mean you can't even really hear it start up like that's how quiet it is for that kind of engine in this kind of truck it's it's pretty crazy guys and just look at this setup like this setup is insane how many other trucks do you really see this in and not too many i can promise you that uh again um it does have a uh, four-wheel drive high four-wheel drive low two-wheel drive button right there uh and here's all your controls for uh the dashboard uh or i mean the head screen or whatever you want to call it it does have the sirius xm like i was just explaining to you for those of you guys that don't know what the Sirius XM is, the Sirius XM is a pretty cool radio. It has over 300 stations, all stations for everybody, literally everybody. It has news, it has um, regular radio, it has um, weather, it has everything that you guys could ever think of. It's definitely a pretty cool feature and they, anytime you get a brand new car or even a used car for that matter, a pre-owned, uh, Sirius XM always gives you a three month free trial uh, and it's pretty it's pretty cool to take advantage of so you get three months for free and then you literally can decide whether or not you want to keep it or you want it to go but I'm telling you right now once you hear Sirius XM you will never want to go back to regular radio I'm telling you right now I've had Sirius XM for the last four years and I will never go back to listening to the regular radio it's just it's so much better and here's some more controls here's your backup cam uh right now it's on demo mode so it's not going to show it right now which kind of sucks because it would be nice if it would show it um your control button right here for your mirror dimmer now what you guys don't know about the mirror dimmer the mirror dimmer is a pretty cool feature as well the mirror dimmer is for those jerk offs that put their high beams on you when they're behind you and so what that does is you press that button right there the mirror dimmer and it will put the mirror on dim so that way um those bright lights behind you will automatically switch to regular lights it's pretty cool like you, you gotta have it to try it to see what it is but it, it's a pretty cool feature um Again, here's all your controls right here, all your apps, uh, your app manager right there. You can put all your apps and your phone onto here, which is pretty cool. It has Wi-Fi hotspot. Tell me how many other work trucks have a Wi-Fi hotspot, guys. Just let me know, because I'm pretty sure most of them don't. And again, it's uh, definitely a very cool feature as well, because if you don't have service on your phone and you need service on your tablet, or your other phone, or uh your laptop or whatever that has wi-fi capabilities all you do is press that button hook it up to your truck and bam you have service anywhere you go inside of your truck guys like that is one of the sickest features that they could have ever done in a truck car or suv it doesn't even matter what it is it, they they're putting that in all things now it's pretty cool um Let's see what else we got here you got settings so you can uh put all the settings the way you like them you got your controls right here for uh your settings and everything it has navigation pretty cool uh so you never get lost especially if your navigation stops working in your phone uh or you don't have any service your truck will have service and it will have the navigation so you will never get lost how cool is that it's pretty cool to me i mean it's pretty cool um here's your trailering control buttons right here ac heat uh this controls the the vents uh how fast you want it to go it's pretty self-explanatory your volume control button your tuner for the radio your traction control button right here uh your hazardous lights you can put it on mute so if you get a call you can uh take it and not have to hear uh the radio in the background uh, again on the regular dashboard all these controls right here control all of those right there which is pretty cool uh, Ram is pretty well known for making their dashboards pretty unique, which is pretty nice uh, Again right there is some more storage space up there uh, another USB charging port up there And right here is your tow haul button and then you got your aux buttons right here for your plow prep package or whatever you hook up to this truck um you can uh you have all these buttons right here to control all that cool stuff and then right here uh is some more 
space that uh well there won't be space there when they put uh whoever buys this truck puts whatever they put in the center so i'm not really sure too much what that'll be uh so i don't want to give you guys the wrong information and then there's some more little space right here and glove box right here which i'm pretty sure i already showed you guys you got your gucci stunner shades spot right there for all those ladies that like to put on those little stunner shades or those guys that like to put on them gucci's right there is where they go and then you got your assist button right there your sos for those of you guys that don't know what that is if you guys ever get into an accident and you guys can't call for help or anything like that it will automatically send your location to cops police and firefighters so you guys will ever have to worry about getting into an accident and not being rescued because those buttons right there are definitely lifesavers because some people that get into accidents get into bad accidents and they can't move or they're scared they don't want to move and all that so it will automatically send the location to those people and you will get rescued right away it, it's a pretty pretty cool feature guys there's some more usb ports right there for your charging your phone your tablet your iphone your android whatever um and then this button right here right here is some more storage space right here which is a pretty cool feature uh, that's pretty awesome put some change put your whatever you want to put in there your cell phone whatever uh, it's just some more storage space which is a pretty cool feature and then uh, yeah guys uh, that's about it um, so I hope you guys are liking my videos. I really hope uh, they're starting to get a little bit better. Uh, again, I'm very new to all of this uh, YouTube creation or YouTube channel or whatever you want to call it. Um, I'm getting there, guys. Um, so please just stay with me. Uh, stay patient. My videos will get better. They'll get a lot calmer. They'll get a lot smoother. And uh, the video will come out a lot better. Um, I know some of my videos come, come off a little rocky and I apologize about that guys one day I'll be an expert for the Photoshop and uh, not the Photoshop uh, I'll be an expert at videotaping or whatever you want to call it uh, YouTubing <laughs> uh, but again April 17th guys we're having another iPhone 11 Pro Max giveaway Again, like I mentioned in my other videos, I wasn't able to go live to show and share it with you guys who won the first iPhone 11 Pro Max because you have to reach a certain threshold for YouTube, uh, a certain amount of subscribers, which I haven't reached yet, and which kind of sucks because everyone else gets to live stream uh, their giveaways and everything, but I can't do that because I don't have a certain amount of subscribers which kind of really sucks, so I have to put it inside of my videos. So a couple of my videos back, uh, I'm, I forgot exactly which one it was, but I mentioned the winner in that video. Um, so I'm sure you guys have seen it or you will see it eventually. But uh, someone did win it, and I did uh, already give it to them, and they were ecstatic about it, and I wish I could have did a video on it because it would have been like a, a quick minute and a half video and then um i'm pretty sure he didn't want to really be videotaped because i did ask him and he just didn't seem like he was really into the whole uh, video life so um obviously i don't want to put anybody on camera that doesn't want to be on camera so i'm not going to do that but anyway yeah so all you have to do is like and subscribe like down there on the left subscribe right there on the right and stay tuned for my next videos like comment and share uh let me know how i'm doing let me know how my videos are let me know what you guys would like me to review next let me know if there's anything i'm missing in any of my videos or what i can do better um constructive criticism is very good i like it uh i like to know what i can improve on um because there's always something that somebody can improve on and do better and that's what i'm trying to accomplish and uh i hope that i get 
and reach to more subscribers and i hope you guys are liking my videos and again april 17th another iphone 11 pro max giveaway all you have to do is like and subscribe it doesn't cost anything to subscribe guys so just hit that subscribe button and that like button and comment and share and you could be that lucky winner guys stay tuned for my next video thanks for watching